Cholo News, Cholo Cholo News. We're chilling with the Cholos and we're looking for the Cholo Cholo News. Orale, this is Manuel Labor. Walking slowly, eh? We're here at one of Albuquerque's biggest car shows, and we love coming to these car shows because you meet some of the coolest people in New Mexico. Came here for the Cinco de Mayo car show and bike show for the Sharing the Road Foundation. So we came to check it out, see what cars they have out there. We've already been spotted out by a couple of people, so now we're going to go and check out, see what kind of cars they have back in here. with Weezer. Weezer, you got a pretty nice car here, bro. Thank you. Tell me a little bit about your car. Uh, this car has came a long way. This car was sitting on blocks when I bought it. Uh, I got it for a thousand bucks. I've got almost five grand into it. Did everything myself, pretty much. <laughs> hey, so how many beautiful chicks can you fit in this car? Oh, man. Yeah, we'll pack it. We'll even put them in the trunk. And how many ugly chicks can you fit in the car? Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Zero. <laughs> So uh, do you rent out your car? Like if I wanted to take your car out, you know, rent it for the night. This car doesn't really leave. Doesn't leave why, bro? Doesn't, doesn't leave the garage unless it's in doesn't, a show. Doesn't leave the police impound. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you probably pick up a, a bunch of chicks in this car, right? I could. So, uh, so what kind of pickup line do you use to pick up chicks with this kind of car? With a car like this, you don't really need to say nothing. It does it all. So basically, your pickup line is uh, jump in the car, bitch. <laughs> is that right? That's it. <laughs> all, right, bro. all right, bro. Hey, thanks, Mr. Man. Right. Appreciate it, brother. Right there. What you heard the news? Que pasión es Hans? What kind of cholo do you think I am? It's my hood and say, check you later, Holmes. Alex also has a beautiful car here at the Albuquerque Car Show. Alex, tell us a little bit about your car. It's an 04 Monte Carlo and uh, I've been working on it for four years. So if your back seat could talk, what would it say? Not a damn thing. Not a nothing damn thing. goes on back there. <laughs> nothing goes on back there. Don't forget about it. <laughs> forget but it. But the trunk might be a different story. <laughs> oh, tell us about the trunk. Who's been in the trunk? Well. Oh, uh, you probably don't want to answer that without a lawyer present. So yes, don't worry about don't go. answer that. We'll edit that off. <laughs> I don't think so. You got a, a name for your car? Untouchable. Untouchable. That's why there's nothing going on in the back seat. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> nothing going on back there in the untouchable. That makes sense. That's a good fitting name for the untouchable. Anything else you want to tell us about your car? Um, six TVs. Six TVs. Six TVs. Oh, we gotta we gotta check this out, man. Hold right, on. Here we go. What do you need six TVs in here for? There's two right there, one in the dash. <laughs> and then I got three more in the trunk. <laughs> so, so Alex is driving down the road and she's watching six TVs, but at least she's not texting. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we're here with Vicente. Vicente has a badass car. Vicente, tell us a little bit about your car, bro. Uh, it's a 63 Impala. Na the name of the car is Cherry Chingon. Cherry Chingon? Yeah. How do you get the name Cherry Chingon, bro? Oh, look at it. Oh, very yeah, nice. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Candy apple red, interior suede and leather. It's all done up, you know what I mean? Bro, if your back seat could talk, what would it say? I don't know about him. <laughs> 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 yeah. Who, who's in your back seat here, bro? Who's, who's, who's your passenger, bro? For a second there, I thought that was my ex-wife, bro. Oh, well. It may be. <laughs> Real close, get <laughs> off. Good man. That's why I dumped her, bro. <laughs> so with a car like this, bro, you can pick up lots of women if you want, bro. So what, what kind of pickup line do you use when you're driving a car like this, bro? Hey, I don't really need to talk too much, you know what I mean? I just fucking jump in the trunk. You know what I mean? <laughs> bro, yeah. I'm sure they in. jump in, but you gotta let them out once in a while. I was spinning there for how long, bro? That's the, the first girl I picked up right there. She's probably been in there for like three, four years, bro. You gotta feed them at least. Put a donut in the window or something, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Get them up. Slow down, get down, show down, cool down. Listen to the gente de todo cholo. Hey, once again, we gotta end the show early, but uh, we'll talk to you next time. Uh, 
Sí, o sea, for our next episode, we're gonna need some bail money. Adios, te guacho. Listen to the gente de todo cholo, ni si wa communication, education, interpretation, imagination, todo cholo. What you looking at, homes? La pachuca, la chingonta, la plebe. El manual labor, walking.